Guys, so I am back home, but I just want to give you guys an update. Basically, I filmed other vlog footage that is all over the place in dates, like from when I moved into university to some classes to some books that I read. And right now it's 17th and I'm on winter break. So I thought I would actually, I actually have time to vlog, record and get some more content for you guys and read more. So I just wanted to give you guys kind of an update and I have a whole to-do list, a little to-do list today that I really want to accomplish and get done because I've been falling behind with my YouTube because of school and because of just other things that have been going on. So I really want to get back into that over the winter break. That's my priority because I have no work to do other than my YouTube stuff. So I'm excited, but I need to tidy my room. I need to put on makeup. I need to clean my camera lens for my other camera. I need to film two videos today. I need to check my business emails, which is a big one. Clara Fox sent me some stuff, so I need to do like a story feature. I, I don't have, I never have to do those. I just like to do them. And then I have to um, include them in a video. So I have a Clara Fox thing. Um, I have to take, I want to take some Instagram photos because I haven't uploaded in months and then start blogging. So all just stuff YouTube kind of related and business email related. So. I'm really excited to just get all this stuff knocked out today and I hope that I do. Um, I'll also give you guys reading updates along the way and stuff like that. There you go, buddy. Need some water. just made my coffee and this morning I'm probably gonna start the clever fox stuff just because I really want to get that done make sure I get that up on time and I answer their business emails I'm gonna do that for a bit and then see how things go fed my cats we good my outdoor feral cats have been fed and my fat boy broody over there has just got fed too yeah I'm so nervous vlogging again it's been so long and it feels like it's been so long so if I'm a little weird I apologize what are you doing what are you doing? Meow? You want water? Water? Water for rough? Come on. Come on. Go, 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 go. There you go, buddy. Go ahead. And that's what happens. <laughs> hey, Sadie. He loves water only from the tap. Like he'll sometimes drink his bowl of water, but most of the time he shows up at someone's sink and waits. So that's that. I tidy my room up quite a bit, so that's done, which I'm really relieved about. I clean my camera lens, so I'm good to go for that in filming. And I'm just putting up right now my story post for Clever Fox. So this is what it looks like. I honestly am not the greatest of these story things, but I just did a quick one on my phone, made a little collage showing it, all that stuff. But yes, I'm super excited about the planner. It's going to be the one that I need to use in the new year. And it's the months, the weeks, and it's like all planned out for you. And then at the back, it has dotted pages for like bullet journaling if you want to do that. And it just comes with a bunch of stuff and it's going to be perfect for 2020. So I'm really excited to use that. Um, I need to do a video actually showing all my old planners and stuff like that and what I used this year and like what kind of worked for me and what I learned and blah 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 blah. So like that could be a fun video. <laughs> Did some cleaning. I started vlogging obviously. Cleaned my camera. All that stuff is done. Makeup, start filming. Maybe take some photos later. And yeah, so today so far has been a productive day. It's only like 10 o'clock and I feel like I've gotten so much done. So yeah, I've missed waking up early because sometimes when I'm up at uni, I don't wake up that early. Or it depends because I go to bed really late up there. I got my cartilage pierced. I, I can insert photos, but yeah, I got my cartilage pierced and this is like my first piercing other than like my two. 
and I love it. So in terms of reading, I did read, um, not last night, but the night before I read Dream Sun Volume 9. I follow this girl named Shimani, who is kind of shy and likes some of the guys that she rooms with and kind of starts falling for some of them. And it's about their like friendship together and everything like that. And it's really light and fluffy and fun. And it's just like a cute manga romance that I would definitely suggest. It's also by the same artist and author who did Orange, which is an amazing manga too. If you're looking for something more hard hitting, that's one to go to. This one is really fun and light and fluffy and this this particular volume, volume 9, wasn't the greatest for me. I think I gave it 2.75. It just... it was okay. Like there was nothing really great to say about it. Like I don't think it was the best manga, like a lot happened in it, but at the same time it's just... I don't know, there's certain parts that definitely lack for me and certain things that I never like about um, mangas, certain tropes I don't like in mangas, but they're always going to be in there, certain tropes are always going to appear, and it's like some of, some of them I really hate, some tropes in mangas, and uh, it's like, I could do a whole video honestly talking about tropes in mangas, but I just got two packages in the mail, so I thought I'd open them for you guys. They're from Simon & Schuster, but I have no idea what they are, and they're like flat packages, so I have no clue. Um, I might have gotten an email, <laughs> like, I don't remember. So it says it's from Simon Schuster, but it's um, a collection from Andrews McMill Publishing of Poetry. The complicated notion of belonging when one's family, culture, culture and country are at odds with one's personal identity, braiding together sexuality, divinity, and conflict, and redemption. The Lost Arabs is a fierce, urgent collection from a distant new voice. Which, this actually sounds really interesting. I haven't heard about this one, so I assume it just came out. But yeah, I'm kind of confused why Simon Schuster sent it from Andrews McMill, but I don't, like, if it's an Andrews McMill poetry collection and Simon Schuster sent it, I'm not sure why that's a thing, but I mean, cool. <laughs> like, thank you. <laughs> thank you so, thank you to Simon Schuster. Like, cool. Oh, it's another one. What? I'm so confused. They gave me two of them? So two of these. I might do a giveaway of one of them. I guess. Um, yeah, uh, thanks to Simon Schuster. Also really random, I don't think I got an email about this. If I did, then I definitely have to check because it's been a bit. Thank you so much for that. I totally appreciate this, don't get me wrong. It's just I'm really confused because I don't remember. I assume these are unsolicited then, which is fine. Um, but got these two. Probably look out for a giveaway because I don't need two copies, so yeah. So it is currently about 12.20. I just finished my makeup and I got so much done already this morning. I tidied my room, I cleaned um, my camera, I need to check emails, um, I put, did the story stuff, started vlogging, so like I did some things, had coffee, had lunch, like the whole shebang, so I'm good, but I haven't put on makeup in so long, especially something this dramatic. So I use this. I use this new palette that I got, which is the Osnap uh, Violet Voss palette, and it's really cool. And it has this really pretty red shade in it. So that's what I mostly used. I used the two red shades, and then a little bit of the black in the crease, and fake lashes, and then my usual kind of routine, um, if you guys care. But yes, I'm pretty happy with it. I'm still not. I'm not wearing normal pants. These are like PJ pants that I'm wearing today, but. Cause you know, they always, <laughs> filming you only see top up, so it's good, but I'm gonna get some photos um, for Instagram and stuff like that, and yeah, I'm pretty happy with today so far, and yeah, most days aren't like this because I haven't gotten this much YouTube and social media stuff done in one day, and like my business email stuff, so I'm glad I got today to work on it, but yes, gonna get some photos taken, is that it? <laughs> and then we got my boy over here, who's just chilling. First video's done. Uh, I'm really happy about it. I think, I hope it turned out okay, and it was super rambly, and like, I, mm, I hope it was okay. I feel super weird. I haven't filmed in so long, and eh, like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm also super hyper today, um, so there's that, but yeah, uh, I think it went okay, and I'm gonna change my shirt, my hair, probably my lipstick, uh, and film another video. And I don't know how many I'm gonna film. I plan to do two, so I think I'm gonna stick with that and not overdo it, because then I feel like the other ones won't be as good. And yes, but I really hope this one turns out okay, and that this vlog turns out okay. And I don't know, I'm just super anxious about uploading again, because I feel like I haven't uploaded in so long, and it's just feels weird. I don't know. I'm sure other content creators can relate, but it's like, I don't know. So this video is done. I put on a pink lipstick, tied my hair up, put on a different shirt. 
Honestly, this is a Bring Me The Horizon shirt that I didn't even know I had. And I don't like their new stuff, but their old stuff is... So I'll wear their merch any... Like, so I wanted to wear it anyways. I finished two videos filmed. I have to do some business emails. And I'm also gonna... I'm gonna relax for the next little bit because I've been filming and running around, so... Yeah, um, I'm really happy about that. I'm also gonna import the photos that I got. Um, my mom helped me take some Instagram photos and stuff, and she always helps me, so like, thanks mom. I wanted to give a shout out to Harper Collins because they sent me, this was a little while ago, I just haven't shown it in a vlog yet, I posted it on Instagram, but Harper Collins Canada sent me a freaking Christmas card and it was so sweet and it made my day, uh, so thank you. And they also sent me an anticipated release. This one is Be Not Far From Me by Mindy McGinnis. I really love her book, The Female of the Species, so I requested this one. I know it's a survival story about hiking and there's an infection on her leg and I just think it's gonna be really interesting, so it's probably gonna be weird too. I almost dropped it because The Female of the Species was really weird, but I'm excited to give you guys my thoughts on this and it's pretty little, so. Hey guys, so it is a few days later and I just want to end off this vlog just because I forgot to end it, but I'm just gonna do this one as like an individual kind of day vlog just because that's how much footage I have and I don't know if I commit to, can commit to daily vlogging or anything, but when I do vlog for the day, I think I should put it all together and upload it and then it'll be really cool. But for now, I just want to end this vlog off. Uh, please let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and if you wanna see more videos like this, let me know update but I hope you guys enjoy the little haul in this video if you want to check out the clever fox planner I'll have it linked down below because they were great and said it to me and I actually started using it for the new year already and started planning a little bit so I'm really excited for that and yeah I hope you enjoyed the hauls and the little bit of reading and just the life updates and all that so yeah I'll see you guys super soon with a new video bye